Hey, what's going on guys and girls? Alcoholic Phoenix here and welcome to episode number 21 on my Red Dead Redemption 2 Let's Play series. So, we've got a stranger's mission to do. Hey, do I know you? Mr. I believe we've met. We have. At that ghastly party. Oh, Evelyn Miller. Unfortunately so, Mr. Arthur Morgan, at least sometimes. Uh, can I say something rude? Sure. The mayor thinks you robbed him. Oh, I, oh, to be clear, he, he wasn't very upset about it. He rather liked you. Okay. Do you, uh, well, I mean to say, uh, can you steal things? Is there a reason you're asking me to incriminate myself, Mr. Miller? Well, I'm sorry. Have you met? Uh, this is Rain's Fall, a great chief, and his son, Eagle Flies. Gentlemen. Great Chief and Eagle Flies, great. Train, crossing the river at Cumberland Falls, and at the party you were upstairs. You have great powers of observation. Yes, my mm. people, if we are even a people anymore, we've fought hard. We've made peace treaties, and those treaties were broken, and we've been moved and punished and punished and moved. I'm sure. And now I am told we are to be moved again. Clearly contravening the peace treaty signed three years ago. This will lead to war. No, my son, we will not. We cannot fight another war. They have got stronger, and we have become far weaker, Mr. Morgan. Well, it's a bad business. It's to do with oil. I know it is, but I need the proof. I believe there were some prospectors who were on their land a few months ago who have filed reports with Leviticus Cornwall and the state government claiming huge reserves of oil under their land. So, you want me to try and steal it? Obviously they can't. <laughs> and even more obviously, I would be useless. <clears throat> Listen, I realize that mm. it is a ridiculous request, but we're very desperate. Now, I'm not a do-gooder, Mr. Miller. Gentlemen, I'm very sorry for your predicament, but... I'm a working man. I got problems of my own. We will pay you very handsomely, Mr. Morgan. How much? I told you, they're all mercenaries. <laughs> <laughs> There's a price on my head in two states, my friend. The government doesn't like me any more than it does you. Like you, I've been running for as long as I can remember. And like you, my time here is nigh undone. We understand, and we will pay. Thank you. You meet my son in a couple of days near Citadel Rock, just west of the oil fields. Okay. We are very grateful for your help. Gentlemen, that appointment with the Senator. We should head over there. It's a waste of our time. And his. We must try everything. Come along. Hello. In a couple days. The counselor wants to apologize. He can see you now. We've been waiting I don't know how long. Or next month, if you'd like to reschedule. Come. Perhaps the senator won't mind waiting. Yeah. Where are we going for this? Meet eagle flies near Cornwall, Kerrison, and Tar. Where the fuck is that? Uh Fuck it, let's just do another bounty, huh? Yeah, how crazy it is that I got a bounty and I'm walking in a police station. Well, you're not here to turn yourself in, so I conclude you're a bounty hunter. May I direct you to the poster on the wall there? Yes, you may. Take it. I might be. I might just want to hang his poster up on my wall. Oh, don't steal it. Oh, fuck me. I nearly accidentally pushed it. Come on, Sally. Um, really should rename the horse, but, you know. Where we going for this? Oh, fuck me. Uncharted territory. Hell yeah, Uncharted Territory. 
I, I find it so interesting that we can literally ride through a town that we've got a bounty of $250, which is like the equivalent of like probably 200000 to two, probably. You okay? Are you okay? Fuck me. Have a sugar cube. Fucking hell, dude. Oh, I was planning on it. Yeah. Then we're fucking... We're just riding through town with like a stupidly high bounty. No issues at all. It's insane to me. So, where's this other place we've got to go to? The, the Cornwall and Tar. Oh my god. Alright. So I guess we'll go do the bounty. Uh, you know what? The bounty can wait. Because we're going to have to cut all the way across anyway. So I guess we'll go up here. To Eagle Flowers. Because otherwise we're going to have to ride back and then ride back out. If you know what I mean. So... I don't, I don't know. Let's head up this way. See what we can find up here. Man, I need food. I've been awake for like two hours and haven't eaten. But I am hungry as a mofo. Very, very hungry. More hungry than I thought I was, apparently. So probably at the airing, like, the time this video airs, well, actually, yeah, it depends. Maybe by the time this video airs and that, uh, Red Dead Redemption 2 Online will be available for me, so you'll probably start seeing videos of this either today or tomorrow. Or like, of the online portion of the game. I may even live stream it, I haven't decided yet. Over what? Here. What? What do you want? What do you want? What do you please, want? Friend. You gotta help me out here. Come on, please. I'm about done here. If I don't get these shackles off soon, I'm a goner. What do you want me to do? Please. This is crazy. Just shoot the shackles. One bullet. That's all. All right. If you stand still, I'd feel more comfortable about it. Come on now. There you go. Waited to hear that noise for so long. Yeah, I bet. I, I wish I could give you some money or, well, you know, I might have something of interest. Okay. You know Ansberg? Well, some lot of die. Rich folks bought up a little cabin up north of there. Very remote. You get me? You sure I'm the right person for this sort of information? I ain't saying nothing. Yep. Do with it what you will. Okay. Thanks, friend. I like how we get honor for helping somebody who's a, who's in shackles. Yeah. Right, let's go, friendo. Dun, 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 dun. So, like, I, I haven't looked much into the Red Dead Redemption 2 online yeah. in terms of what content there is. Uh, I do know you can pick male or female gender, of course, and stuff like that. It's only been out for five hours-ish, or well, four hours as of the time of this recording. So I haven't had a chance to, like, sit down and watch some on Twitch or YouTube or anything and, like, get an idea of what we're getting into with that. But I am pretty excited for it because... Maybe it would give a chance for a few of the friends that I know that have brought Red Dead Redemption 2. We can all play it together. You know, that could be that could be a fun time. I remember playing the original Red Dead Redemption online with some friends, and that was a hell of a time, so I'm looking forward to it, really. Really looking forward to it. I really should use the stagecoaches more often to go to places like this so I'm not riding for so long. 
Like, I've got such an excessive amount of money at the moment that spending $20 to fast travel somewhere really isn't much of an issue. We should be getting close, right? We have to be. Oh my fucking god. Yeah, we should be getting close, dude. No problem. <laughs> Righto, whatever you say. Alright, let's do this. Get our sprint on. Just ADS by accident. This is a very pretty game, I will say that. Like, this is undoubtedly pretty. Why is it red up here? Shit. Go, 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 go. Are they following me? Can't tell. I don't think they are. What just appeared on the map for me? Why is Eagle Fly's mission locked out? Don't you fucking do that shit. If I come all the way over here and I can't do it, I'm gonna be so pissed off. There we go. Oh, probably because they were, they were near me. That's probably why. I thought I was going to be in combat with some raiders or something, and all of a sudden I wasn't, so it was like, yeah, you're good. Let me just go in here. How you doing, Eagle Flies? You know, that's cheating. Using binoculars like that. How you doing? Well, what's the haps, dude? He came. Of course I came. Said I would. There's a foreman. His name is Danbury. Is the files in the office above the refinery room. It's that window with the blind drawn up. I see. If the files are as incriminating as we believe, Mr. Cornwall's men will destroy them if they know you're coming. There's only one of me, son. I don't intend for them to know I'm coming. What will the files say? There'll be a report from Leyland Oil Development Company. And you got the money? Yes. Any ideas how I sneak into this place? You could crawl under the fence or hide in a wagon. They keep rolling in. I'll go take a look. If there's a problem, call for me. I thought the whole point was that this had nothing to do with you. Ideally. If you are quick, you could climb into the back of that wagon. Had myself muted, didn't realize. Smashed my shins on the wagon as I jumped in. Holy crap, the weather turned so fast. It was so nice and sunny and now it's shithouse. We've been here before. We had to steal a wagon. We, we went to grab a wagon from here last time. Hey, Tom. Pick it up. Yep. Supposed to meet the early train to Saint Denis. Okay. Better get a move on then. Don't notice me, please. That's so risky, dude. It's insane.
This is probably gonna go horribly wrong. We get out of same uh, camera mode. Jesus. We have. Ah, that's good. Holy shit. I'm sorry. Danbury. Yes. I need some papers, my friend. Nothing important. A file. I'm from head office. You're not from head office? Does that seem important right now? No. I need a file by the Leland Oil Development Company. The one about the oil near Wapiti. I... I... Hmm? Danbury. Big man. Mine is a terrible thing to lose. Especially over such a nice I... floor as this. Come on. It's here. It's here. Where? Where? Thank you. Good, Danbury. Real good. They'll give you a promotion for this. Nope. Danbury. Danbury? Danbury, you okay? Tell the guard you're fine. Yes. All's fine. Now stay quiet. Or head office will send me back to get you. Sweet. Escape through the office window. Catch you later, dude. Whee! Hey, 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 hold it right there. Weapons what? on the ground and hands in the air. Easy now, fellas. Now, we won't tell you again. Oh, Jesus. Go, 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 go. Oh, you did! Many, many times! No shit! Oh, what's up, dude? You know, a gun wouldn't hurt instead of a bow and arrow, but I guess if you're good with it... No harm, no foul. Of course they are. With that lock on, there we go. I'm sorry, horse. Get the fuck out of there somehow. We're almost clear. I think we are clear, but okay. The explosion came just in time. I was happy to watch some of that oil burn. So you met Mr. Danbury? Yes, don't worry, he was very obliging. I thought you wasn't getting involved. 
thought you were going to enter and leave silently. Thank you. Well, I tried to. Thank you. I hope. Well, I don't know what I hope. But who knows? Maybe these will be of some use. Here's your money. Cheers, homie. Thank you. What did we get for that? 250. Gang share? Fuck off. They didn't have any involvement in what we did. Not one bit. Ass face. What do we got here? Is it Henry Lamarck's? I mean, do we really have a choice? We don't have much else that we can do. We do this bounty hunter mission now. Oh god, it's gonna take so long to get back there though. I really don't care that much. Yep. I was really hoping that, you know, a, an actual story mission would show up by now, but that doesn't seem to be the case. For whatever reason. Just throw your tin on the ground, it's fine. Oh, there we go, Dutch mission. Fuck yeah, dude, let's do it. We're doing it, doing it, do, 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 doing it, doing it. Someone's on the. I don't remember the song. Someone's at the door. I don't care, cause we're doing it, doing it. Mm hmm. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. So I think the way it worked is I had to do that stranger's mission, which is why it was in yellow, because it was a prerequisite to get a, the story mission to unlock. So that's fine. It was just very far out of, out of the, uh, away from the camp. Let's just say that, it was a long distance. Yeah, fuck you, I don't care. I'm not going to argue with them. Lemoyne! $260 bounty. Like I said, I wonder, I wonder what the currency conversion of that would be. I wonder if I can look that up while we're riding here. Currency conversion. Well, I guess it would be, uh... Inflation. Inflation calculator. Uh, a basket of goods valued at $260. Oops. Oh, let me turn. At $260 in calendar year... What is it? 19... Shit. 1908 or something, right? In 2018 would cost... Values must be in pounds, shillings and pence for periods before... 66. Use our pre-decimal inflation calculator for this calculation. Um, I mean... I'll work it out later. It doesn't matter. Why are we? We're way off track. That's what I get for looking at stuff instead of riding. Come on. We have to turn here. I'll figure it out later. Maybe during one of the cutscenes I can look it up or something.
It's uh, six thousand six hundred and six dollars in twenty seventeen. Are you fucking kidding me, dude? Okay, okay, keep the hair off. Ah, my horse is running away. Calm down! Fuck! <laughs> Just collided with the dude. There we go. Yeah, it's between it's between six and a half to seven thousand dollars in today's money. Oh fuck off! I ran into him by accident. Piss off a crime. I didn't kill him or anything. Assholes. Take more than that, boy. Yeah. Get those cores refilled. Yeah. Just eating a wallet full sprint. Unbelievable. You need a brush, fella. I can give you a brush. Eddie, I'm just brushing my horse. Hey, mister. You make me uneasy. You fucking walked up to me. You're making me uneasy, even though I came trotting over to you. You've made me uneasy. I am uncomfortable with how close you are to me right now. Oh my god, this is creepy as fuck. What an atmosphere. Hey, Dom. It's me. No shit, I'm alive. All right, Dutch. What's the plan, Areno? Wow, the camp fund's a dollar twenty. Shut up! I'll have it shit wherever I wanted to have it shit, alright? Don't you fucking tell me otherwise. Um, so I think... Oh, fuck. It's a city, there are police, but as far as we can tell, the patrols will all be going this way when Abigail and I cause the diversion. That's the opportunity. What do you think, Arthur? I don't see we have a lot of choice. We linger around here, we know we're dead, but the plan. We got a decent bunch, we know how to fight. The city cops don't seem so tough as long as we move fast. I reckon doing it in the day with a distraction. If that's what Jose is saying, it's as good a plan as any. I think I agree. When we do it at night, there's the dram of just getting into the bank. Can't do that silently. No, pick us off far easier. I know. I'm I'm just making sure. Every plan is a good plan if we execute it properly. Every problem we had was because we did not execute properly. Even Blackwater, from my understanding. You're right. Let's rob this bastard. Everyone get some rest. We ride out in the morning. Look smart. Let's do it. Travel light. Oh, howdy. Sure. So, we rob ourselves a bank, and within six weeks, we're living life anew in a tropical idol, spending the last of our days as banana farmers. Let's get out of this godforsaken place and go rob ourselves a bank. <laughs> Hell yeah, dude. Oh, let's go. Crack that whip, Mr. Matthews. This is it, gentlemen. The last one. Where have we heard that before? What has happened to you, John? You lost all your heart. I'm just trying to stay real about all this. Real? Oh, how I detest that word. So devoid of imagination. How soon are we shipping out? Soon as we get a passage organized. Boat down to Argentina, then another around the Cape. What about the money in Blackwater? We're just gonna leave that behind? 
Forget that. It's gone. You all talk like it's the only goddamn money in the world. We're gonna take that and more. Take it from the people who take it from us. This isn't some hick town hundred dollar operation. This is a big city bank. Right. With security, guards, police. Hosea has done his reconnaissance. We've been over this. The plan. One last time. Have a little Hosea fight. And Abigail draw out the police. We go in calm and fast. John and Lenny secure the front doors. Javier takes the side exit. Bill, Micah, and Charles control the crowd. Me and Arthur deal with the bank manager and vault. Got it? Got it. Yep. Got it. Gentlemen, let us go ahead. How long do you need? Not long. Fifteen minutes or less. You'll know by the noise. Any problems? We'll see you in camp. Good luck, gentlemen. Hey. Seen heading in like some posse of country outlaws. This is it, cowboys! One more time! Well, one more time. Let's ride! Yeah! All right, I'm so fucking pumped, dude. So, what do we got? Micah, Dutch, and John with us. Is that right? Very fancy. Nothing to get your fucking blood pumping like a big ass bank robbery in the center of a city. There's Bill. Let's hitch up here. God, Bill looks like a fucking derelict idiot. Gentlemen, robbing thieves, it ain't no crime at all. Folk like this, they stole what this country could have been. Stay mm. cool, fellas. Act natural. Wait for Hosea to do his thing. This, this is better work. Looks like there's law over the other side. Have a modicum of faith, John, will you please? Soon as we get out, load everything onto the wagon here. Alright. Jesus! <laughs> he is a true artist. Let's go. The old mask on. Let's go, ladies and gentlemen. This is a hold up. Don't do nothing stupid. Everybody in the back. Okay, now then, Arthur. Let's go. Thank you. Oh my god, that is fucking horrifying! <laughs> Open the vault. Come on. Thank you. Into the vault. And then he locks us inside. Okay, 
Okay, I'm in. Dope. <laughs> well, well, well. Holy shit, they weren't joking. Nah, yeah, no, you're right. You serious? We're not. We're, that's that's all we're gonna rob. Think we got a problem out here? Come out! It's over! Shit! Abigail! Dutch! Get out here! Get out here! Oh, this out. piece of shit! Squeal. Never should have gone after Bronte, Dutch. Mr. Milton, <clears throat> let my friend go. For folks, they are gonna get shot unnecessarily. Your friend? <laughs> Why would I do that? Come on, Milton. It's over. No more bargains. No more deals. Mr. Milton, this is America. You can always cut a deal. I've given you enough chances. Come on. Oh, what the fuck? No! God damn it! <laughs> Let me just move the PlayStation close enough that I can put my fucking controller charger in. Well, this was a bit of an oversight, wasn't it? Way to ruin my momentum. God damn it. You stang screwed up my momentums. Fucking Hosea though, dude. No. Oh my god, the headshots are real, dude. Holy fuck! I'm coming! Get over here! Place the dynamite. Hosea, man, he was a good one. Holy fuck, dude. There are so many cops. Oh my God. Woo! Go. 
Got him in the head. We lost control of the bank. The others are trying to hold him off. Okay. Can I hit a shot? Got him. Oh my god, what happened to his arms? Oh! There we go. Fuck me. I just could not hit that guy. Arthur. We lost John. Killed? Arrested. I couldn't help. Well, we better go. We'll be next. What you think? I reckon me and Lenny try and find a way across the roofs. So if you'll cover us. Sure. Sure. Go on. Shit. One final score, huh? Not Lenny! Oh no! Fuck me, dude. It's fucking Micah. It's gotta be. It's fucking Micah. What now? I don't know. I don't. This whole town is filled with cops. Well, how long are we gonna stay here? Well, a few hours? We go back to camp? They're gonna get every last one of us. I know they're gonna be watching the roads. I got it. A boat. What you mean? We stay here till nightfall. Then we sneak on down to the docks. We get ourselves out of here. Yeah, well, where? Any place will do. That's all I got. We leave. We lie low. We come back for the rest in a few weeks. I'm guessing it's that. We die out there right now. Exactly. Now, everybody, calm down. I mean, oh, look at us. It's fucking Micah, dude. I'm telling you, it's Micah. He's a piece of shit. I don't trust him one fucking bit. I'd blow his fucking brains out if I was allowed to. Keep your heads down. <clears throat> Jesus. Guards up ahead. What now? Just wait a second. God damn it. This night just keeps getting better, doesn't it? Quick, get in cover and stay out of sight. Looks like they've stopped. We'll go through the train, Arthur. Come on. Press you. Follow when it's clear.
Why am I stuck? Someone's coming. Duck. Oh shit. How would you not uh, excuse me, how would you not see me? For real though. I already checked the trains. You did? No more than a quarter hour ago. Are you sure? Sure. Ooh. Come on. Close. The John got arrested. We lost Hosea. We lost Lenny. Someone whistle out here? Shit, another one. Jesus. Everyone stay down and keep quiet. Oh shit. Do you think I plan on making fucking noise apart from whistling? Silently, so when they chase me, you go the other way. What are you talking about? You heard what I said. Oh, I like it. Real brave. What in the hell? Who is excuse me, buddy? Hey, stop! Stop, stop! That is one of the most beautiful acts I ever saw. Come on. As long as he doesn't get killed, I'll look. Well, he won't. Thinking about it. What now? Well, at least we got some gold, I'm sure. This boat ain't going to Tahiti by any chance. I don't know. John, Lenny, Jose, that wasn't good. I don't know. So what are we gonna do now? <coughs> Guess I'm gonna introduce myself to the captain. Give him some of this gold to secure his silence and find out where we're heading. How do I look? Like a shifty, no good killer on the run from the law. Ain't that the truth? <laughs> Excuse me, sir. Hey, who are you? Forgive me. A stowaway. Can I see the captain, please? I come in peace. <sighs> Fuck. Well, it's gonna take a little more gold, but I think we're gonna be okay. This captain, he is a, a fine fella. A New Englander from the Cape. The rest of the ship is Frenchmen. They're heading down to the islands, taking some Pennsylvania coal. Now, apparently, we're going to be able to slip ashore in northern Cuba in a couple of days. That's so. Apparently. Cuba. Fucking Cuba, my man. What are we going to do in Cuba, Dutch? Hold up for a while, then hurry back, gather up the rest of our family. At least we got some money now. Money... And loyalty. 
With that, you can do whatever you please. So you reckon they'll follow us to Cuba? Like Colonel Waxman on a jolly? I highly doubt it. I reckon we hold ourselves to ourselves, and this is done and dusted. Let's hope so. I ain't no sailor, but, uh... <clears throat> that cloud look like good news to you? <laughs> Not really, no. Telling you, man, Mike is fucking selling us out. Everybody, wake up, wake up. Oh, Come shit. Wake up, wake up, wake up, wake up. I don't know, but we are getting off of this boat. You come on. Would you get a move on, you sleepy bastard? Please, Lord, hey, I'll be right behind you. Jesus. Jesus. Oh, fuck. Dance. Dance. I'm okay. You? Yeah. No. This ain't moving. No. Yeah, you go on ahead. I'll try and find another way. Oh, God damn it. Quite the storm. Oh, shit. The boat's on fire! How the fuck is the boat on fire to get hit by lightning? Oh, that, that looks weird. What happened to me? I'm negative. Oh, we got to the shore of somewhere. That's a positive. Welcome to the new world. Okay. Get up. Somehow alive is where you are. I don't know how, but you are. Let's just keep walking, I guess. Well, it looks like we're in a somewhat tropical paradise. I guess we're on rails here. Yeah, we're on rails. We can't walk wherever we want. We just walk. For how long? I don't know. That was like a fucking lizard man.
It wasn't a lizard man, but it was a lizard man. Fuck, man. Chapter five, Guama. Washed ashore. You don't say. Oh man, our shit's all fucked up. Smoke. Can I walk over there? Or am I still on rails? Seems like I'm still on rails, dude. Who are you? Something to drink. Have a drink. Somebody yeah. give him a goddamn drink. Oh, son. Son, take it easy. Oh, we got God, you. God, look at Micah's stomach, dude. So. Where the hell are we? We are on the island of Guarma. Javier asked a local. It's a old sugar plantation island. Second island east of Cuba. Is it anywhere near Australia or Tahiti? It's on the way, I guess. So, what next? I don't know. <laughs> We have well, police looking at next, us. Next, I guess we're gonna get shot. Gentlemen, this is quite a welcome. Who are you? Senor, por favor. We are no one. What's your name? Aiden O'Malley. Is that so? What are you doing, Mr. O'Malley? Surviving. We were lost at sea in the storm. Is that so? No. I'm in the habit of looking like this. Is all of this really necessary? We got enough troubles around here right now, Mr. O'Malley, without taking a chance on a bunch of vagabonds. Behave yourselves and no harm will befall you. Vamos! Right. This is exactly what I wanted. Let's go. We got another group rounded up down the way. Fuck's sake, dude. Are you kidding me? Get your drift, Mr. Uh... Levi Simon, senior overseer for Alberto Fusar. We run the third most productive sugar plantation in the Northern Caribbean. Of course, where there's money to be made, there's trouble. What sort of trouble? No, oh, the usual sort. People wanting what ain't theirs and others telling them to take it. I don't get you. Labor troubles. And other thieves and pirates looking to disrupt our ways of working. How very upsetting for you. Not half as upsetting as it'll be for them. Mr. Fusar has a lot of very powerful friends. Of course he does. I will bet that he does. Bunch of Haitian pirates won't frighten him. They'll be strung up in the streets soon enough. And do we seem like Haitian pirates to you, Mr. Simon? seem like someone or other we was headed to tahiti you was going to scenic route just as soon as i know exactly who you are you'll be free in the meantime you'll not starve Cabo, 
Llévese a estos hombres a la cárcel, junto con el grupo de cucarachas de ese campesino. Cualquier tontería que hagan, disparales a todos. Welcome to Kama, gentlemen. Now, if you'll excuse me. Yeah. What now, Aiden? I don't know. What do you think? I think we've got to get out of here. Yeah, but they can't find out who we are. Well, for now, we're stuck, Ben. Great. Well, for what it's worth, I think I would have preferred Tahiti. You and me both. It looks so nice. Don't think I'd want to live there personally, but it does look very nice. Who are these people? Who knows? Well, they got them chained and lashed, but they don't look too dangerous. Excuse me, sir. Who are our new friends here? <laughs> What crime did they commit? Insurrection. <laughs> Insurrection? That's quite a word. Cállate, señor Fuente. Cuévate. Todos. Mmm. Great. That I tried to uproar against the government, huh? Don't fall behind in the chain gang as I'm basically smacking Dutch's heels. At least he's got fucking shoes. He's running like he shit himself. I'm at least semi walking. He's like, uh, 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 uh. What about the others? Bill looks ridiculous. Ah! Oh, Jesus! Shit, my dude. I don't think so either. Oh my god, can I shoot him, please? Fuck me. Everyone okay? Uh, yeah. Uh. Damn. Reinforcements. What do you? We need to get out of here. Now we're in trouble. Come on, come on, Tevi, everyone, follow me. Quick, Tevi, come, come, come. Ah. 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 Javier! Oh, get out of no. here. No. Get out of here, there's a lot of them. Ah. What do you think? We gotta move, Dutch. Go. Don't lose face, son. We'll find you. Cooey, cooey. Go, go. Fuck. Ah. I tried to pick up a carbine. Guess what you shouldn't do? Lose faith. Oh, thank you. You've got to be kidding me, dude. Oh! Why does it sway randomly like that? Hit him. Got him. 
Got him again. It's Pony Island. Police, I guess. Or kind of. I got a lot of them now. Come on. Ooh. Follow me. Quick. Holy shit, dude. How long is this mission? What are you doing here? I have no idea. Running from somebody or something, I guess. How went we all? Hercule Fontaine. Dutch Vanderland. These drowned rats are Micah, Bill, and Arthur. Okay. Well, Fusa will be desperate to find you. We must be very careful. So, who is this Fusar? A tyrant. Driven by nothing but power and greed. Our only mm. purpose is to work ourselves to death to make him rich. Leon wants the people to stand up to Fusa, but most are too afraid. And you? I am not from here. I bring things in and off the islands behind Colonel Fusa's back. Oh. Let's, uh, let's rest a moment. Down there is Aqua Dolce, Fusa's compound. The sugar cane these poor men kill themselves farming gets processed in that factory there. They're little more than slaves shipped in from other islands. A group escaped yesterday into the jungle, hoping to find a way back to their homes. Now Fusa's men are out hunting them down. That old fort? Cinco Torres. My men mm. and I use that as a hideout when we are here. Come on. I know somewhere you men can rest. Can we trust you? I don't see you have any choice. I am the only one who can arrange a boat for you. But, I need something in return. Okay. Help Leon with that group of escape workers, and then come meet me at the fort. If you help us get back our friend, and get out of here, we will do everything we can. Thank you. Gracias. If your friend is still alive, they will have him at Futa's compound. There is a cave hidden below the cliffs. It will lead you right there. Thank you. The workers are somewhere in the jungle. Hopefully we can get to them before Fusa does. Of course. Gentlemen. Well. Goodbye. If this is a tropical paradise, so far it ain't up to much. I'll go scope the entrance to that cave. Arthur. I need to get some rest. Well, you're right. We all need to relax. <clears throat> what a mess. I am so sorry, boys. Get some sleep, Dutch. Micah, guard this spot. Bill, uh, do some more scouting. Carefully. Nope, we're awake. Like a... Goddamn radish. Alright. So... Anyway, guys and girls, that is going to be the end of this episode. If you liked it, remember to leave a like. If you want to see more Red Dead Redemption 2 in the future, be sure to hit that subscribe button. Don't forget to follow me on all my social media links down in the description below. Thank you all so much for watching, and I hope you all have a lovely day. All right, poi!